Uh, the first of class flight trials are important as they give the Navy the opportunity to increase the capability uh, between the MH60 Romeo and the LHD class of ships by increasing the range of environmental conditions that the two can operate in together. So the capability that first of class flight trials will provide Navy is the opportunity to operate the Seahawk uh, in a greater range of configurations. So it will be better suited to a configuration for ASW or ASUW, uh, and also gives us the opportunity to operate the Seahawk as a HADR platform potentially, depending on its configuration. So we've come up here to the Coral Sea where the temperatures are a little warmer to assess the performance of the aircraft in uh, high temperatures. Uh, and we also hope to get some pitch and roll uh, that we can induce into the ship's deck through a sea state and higher wind uh, from the head of the ship so that we can assess the aircraft's performance in high winds. And once we're finished with the high winds, we also hope to get light variable winds so we can work at the bottom end of the spectrum also. So throughout the flight trial on Adelaide, we're collecting a lot of data from the flying operations that we do uh, through the instrumentation system on the aircraft, which is fed back to the ship. Uh, we collect all that data for analysis post flight trial. Uh, and what we hope to do is expand the envelope that we operate in uh, including investigating things like running takeoffs, uh, birth rep and transfer evolutions, and landing uh, and taking off from the various spots on the ship.